Hi, Wade Artists. Today we're going to start a summer landscape inspired by the contemporary artist Anna Blattman. Start by writing your name and class code on the back of your paper. Remember, not too big and not too small, just right. Hold your paper like a bathtub and then fold it in half. Then fold it in half again. And open up your paper and hold it tall like a shower. Lightly draw a horizon line on the top line. It can be hilly or flat. Lightly draw lines across the other folded lines. Then draw lines in between. You should have five lines. One, two, three, four, five. Find a dark green paint stick and draw a line across the horizon. Remember, the horizon line shows you where the ground meets the sky. Fill in between this section with green to make some grass. I think I'll add a little of this light green color to make it look like the sun is shining on the grass. Now use blue above your horizon line to fill in the sky. I'm going to leave some of the white paper showing to look like clouds. You could also use a white paint stick. Now decide if you want to use the warm colors or the cool colors for your flowers. I think pink could go with the warm or the cool colors. I think for my landscape, I'm going to use the warm colors. I'm going to start with red and pink. I'm just working my way across the first section, making short vertical red stripes. Now I'm going to fill in between and make some pink stripes. For my second row of flowers, I think I'll add another warm color, maybe orange. And I think I'll go with yellow instead. Now let's add some pink. Try not to let any of your white paper show. Now I'll move down to my third row. Let's finish up by adding another row along the bottom. I think I'll add a few orange lines. Fill 
fill in all those white spots I like to call ghosties. Today we will be adding a little house and some trees using some painted paper. Place the house where you would like it to go somewhere along the horizon line. Now I'm going to cut a trapezoid to make the roof. This looks a little tall. Let's trim off the top. Or that fits just right. Cut out a small black rectangle for the door. Now on the back of some green painted paper, draw some bumpy circles or ovals. Let's carefully cut these out. I'm speeding up my video, but you should take your time. These will be the top of my trees. Now let's get everything glued down. Don't forget to put your cap on your glue stick. The last step is to use a brown oil pastel to make a letter Y for the trunk. Looking at my finished piece, I still see a few white ghosties. I'm going to use this light green to fill in those. This will look like grass peeking through some of the rows of flowers. There, I think I'm all done. I hope you have fun creating a summer landscape inspired by the artist Anna Blattman.